anything that we can do to help, to help get Fresno State the exposure that it really, really deserves is something that we should all be interested in doing. I'm so grateful that I work at a place that values supporting faculty research, faculty artistic creation, because I think that really enhances the education of our students. The exposure to the liberal arts, the exposure to literature, the exposure to music, those are the things that you take away from a college education that you'll never get anywhere else. I know that in the music department, one of the things we really value and we really try to propagate is that we not just teach the student, but we interact with the student, we work with the student, so that the student has the experience of working with a true professional. It is the College of Arts and Humanities. It's humanities. It's understanding what goes on around us and how we affect the world around us. When I consider that there's other people in the world that are not able to read and write, you know, and I have the opportunity to know how to read and write, uh, then how can I use that tool to communicate with others, you know, at my job, at school, with my family, at church. For me, it's a tool uh, uh, for empowerment and for change. State budget for higher education has been cut and cut and cut. And the places where it's cut are places that affect both the students and the faculty. We decided that it was time to do something to support Fresno State. We developed the, the Dean's Council. And the Dean's Council was basically set up with two parts. Half of a donation would go to an endowment for scholarships, and half of the money would go to a Dean's discretionary fund. Dean Diaz uh, awarded me a scholarship to help cover um, most of my first semester. And I told him, I was like, I don't know how to thank you, you know? And so he told me, he's like, the way that you can thank me is by doing your best and pr pretty much, you know, by, um, as in don't give up, you know, complete the program and that would, that would, that'll be a way for you to thank me and the, the college. I hear only a few bars, and when the trucks barrel down the broken street, the music is lost. I've been involved with two very serious projects with U.S. Poet Laureate and Pulitzer Prize winning poet Philip Levine, who's a professor emeritus here in the Fresno State campus and is extremely well known. We merged his poetry with my music. The thing I'm so thrilled about with the jazz project is that it does justice I think, to Philip's poetry. So I went back through all of the 29 tracks we'd recorded for the jazz project, and I started to notice that Philip talked about water, he talked about rain, he talked about clouds, he talked about environmental degradation, and he talked about drought. I think one of the unique things about this project as a faculty research project or creative activity 
and I'm very proud of this, is the level to which students and faculty have been involved, besides myself. Uh, five faculty members were participated with the Waterless Music video. There's no way that I could be involved in this level of artistic creation and production and dissemination without some kind of financial support. The Bonner Foundation very generously chipped in money that then was very generously matched by the college and that's what enabled the waterless music to, to happen and enabled it to be uh, recorded at such a high level. My job here is to teach students how to analyze music, how to think about music, how to, how to creatively problem solve, and how to compose new works and how to disseminate those works. So I'm modeling for my students how to do that and how to do that hopefully at a very high artistic uh, level. This is why we do what we do. We try and bring people into the fold, let them know what's happening here at State that cannot be compared to anything else. If every alumnus that we have gave $10 a year to the university, we would have over $3 million a year in donations. Over 300,000 living alumni. Giving to Fresno State is a good thing. And it's a good thing for you, it's a good thing for me, and it's a great thing for the community.